Like, the delusion has to stop, bro. Men and women have to improve communication, specifically black men and women, because we are trending in the wrong direction. Hear me out, right? As a man, single man, looking for a lifelong mate. Let's just say that, right? At no point in my search for a partner am I expecting them to accept things from me that I'm not willing to accept from them, or am I expecting them to do things for me that I wouldn't do for them? That's the basis of any healthy relationship is reciprocity. Y'all talk about being equally yoked. That's essentially meaning that both sides of the scale weigh the same so it's evenly balanced. That's harmony, right? You can't achieve harmony by expecting people to treat you better than you treat them. And I think that's what a lot of women, right? And when I talk about women, I'm only talking about black women because I'm a black man. That's all I care about. At no point, like, I mean, I feel like a lot of our black women expect our men, meaning us, if we're going to be in a relationship with them, they want it to be a disproportionate bond. Meaning that you're giving more than I'm giving. And they and they, and they say this shit with a straight face. Like, case in point, right? It's this post that's been floating around the internet. So this was a post shared by a young lady. This was her words verbatim that she typed. It's this dude in my complex that stayed trying to talk to me, right? But I'll never pay him no mind for real. So while I'm struggling trying to bring in some groceries, a case of water, and keep my son from running down the street, right? And he going to say, see, this is why you need a man. I said, well, can you maybe help me real quick? Y'all, why the nigga going to say, no, nah, not me? I tried to be the man you needed. I washed my hands of you the last time. I said, hi. Why I drop the case of water and they start rolling everywhere and he going to look at me and tell me I should call my baby daddy? And it's a lot of men and women in the comments, as usual, with, opposed, with opposing views. We have a lot of women saying, what happened to being chivalrous? What happened to being kind? He can still help her out. Completely negating and omitting the fact that this woman admitted to ignoring this man as he repeatedly made advances to get to know her. Some women even say, well, it's harassment to keep on um, asking someone out if they're not interested. Okay, let's run with that. So if it's harassment, why would you expect the person harassing you to help you? When a person is harassing you, you don't want interactions with them. You can't just say, hey, I know you're harassing me, but at this moment, your harassment would be convenient based on my needs in life. So I'm not willing to accept this harassment as long as you're doing what I want you to do. It's narcissism. So many of our women are narcissists, bro. Like, you legit want someone to omit and overlook how poorly you treated them in your time of need. And this is so many people on earth, bro. So many people, like, don't understand, like, you reap what you sow. That means how you treat me is how I'm going to treat you. And if you don't like how you're being treated, treat me better. And if you treat me better and I don't match the energy and treat you better, stop interacting with me. It's that simple. It's really that simple. Y'all make it so hard, bruh, because y'all want a nigga to lose to fuck with you. And it's not worth it. Like, seriously, you're offering pussy in exchange for better treatment than you treat me. And maybe pussies ain't hitting like they used to, because I'll be damned if I'm going to treat you with more respect than you're giving me. I'll be damned if I'm going to be more cordial to you than you are to me. If I'm going to be more accommodating to you than you are to me. No. Look at men and how they interact with other men. The basis of almost every relationship that men have with other men is based on reciprocity. You got my back, I got your back. You might have my back with some simple shit. I might have your back with some more complicated shit. The thing is, is when you ask me for help, I had your back. Just like when I asked you for help, you had my back. Men do not maintain bonds with people who don't treat them fairly. We don't. You don't have to on earth. You have, you have a choice. Some of y'all are choosing to interact with people who don't treat you like you treat them. Shame on you. I think this man handled this shit as well as he possibly could. You don't fuck with me, I don't fuck with you. Enjoy your day. Does it make him any less of, than a fucking man? Not at all. It makes him a dude that has boundaries and he's respecting yours. You have boundaries, bitch. Now he does too.